Hey guys, good morning. I am currently in the middle of getting ready. It is Tuesday and I wanted to record this video earlier in the week for you guys and hopefully make it into a couple days in my life type of vlog. I know I haven't been on here in a while so I'm excited to be back. So as you guys know, the weather has completely changed from one day to another. One day it was summer and we were all out in our summer dresses. The next it was literally fall and we had to rearrange your closet so i started placing some orders and i bought a couple of things for fall to start building my wardrobe so today i'm going to show you some of those items um i have everything already set up everything is there it's a lot and i wanted to get to it as soon as possible because i want to put everything away that having it there is just bothering me i recently started using a, a lash serum i don't want to say recently it's been actually about a month and a half and i see such a huge difference when i use mascara my lashes look a lot fuller they look longer and it just made a huge difference and this is actually the mascara that i've been loving it is the l'oreal air volume mega mascara i think it works so good okay so before i get to showing you everything because it will take a little while i'm going to do my hair i'm going to curl it first and then i'm going to show you what i do to kind of revive my hair after like day five or day six um i've been doing this for a while and it's working out so good for me so i'm able to extend my hair wash day which i love because washing my hair is a whole thing first i'm going to curl my hair then i'll get back on here to show you guys what i do after and to curl my hair today i'm actually going to use one of my favorite hair tools um these are from t3 micro this is the t3 twirl trio i do have another curling iron too but i didn't have this one this one comes with three different sizes so depending on the type of curl that you want every time they have a sale i do post about it because i love these hair tools these are the only ones that i pretty much use and i recommend them all the time okay so this is what you attach the wands to so this is a thicker one the smaller one and the medium one okay i just wanted to show you it comes with this bag so you can put the other barrels and everything else once you're done and i love it because it's super travel friendly and you can just keep everything together here okay i'm all done i hate this angle i'm sorry if you guys are like what is going on this angle is like the only thing that works right now because my tripod is somewhere where i can get it so i'm trying to prop you guys on a bunch of boxes <laughs> i wish you guys could see this it looks crazy but this is the best i could do for now so we're going to work with it all right so i am done curling my hair so this is pretty much what makes a huge difference and it's like i said it's something that i've been doing for the last couple of weeks now and it's been working like wonders for me so i'm going to just spray on some dry shampoo like i usually would this is from batiste it is the dry shampoo original scent it's actually my favorite all right i'm going to let it sit there for a little bit and then i'm going to grab my hair dryer so i'm going to first blow dry my roots at a medium to high heat so i'm going to turn my head upside down and i'm just going to blow dry my roots on a regular heat setting and then i'm going to switch it to the cool setting and i'm going to do the same thing but i'm going to do it for a little bit longer <laughs> it looks crazy right now but just work your fingers through it look at all this volume it kind of looks like i just literally washed my hair and curled it just makes such a big difference but i think i'm going to curl this piece right here because i think it really needs it and then i'll get on to show you guys everything that i got all right so first let's start with target and let me show you this t-shirt first it is an oversized t-shirt and i literally wear it all the time when fall starts i usually become a homebody i don't like leaving my house i don't like doing much and oversized t-shirts are just amazing next i have this basic turtleneck 
tank top i already tried it and i have makeup all over it but i love it because it's kind of like it's not stiff but it is a thicker material so it kind of like cinches you in and i love the color they had a bunch of different colors i got this in an extra small and it was 15 dollars. next i got this black skirt i always look for good black skirts i don't know why but i think these are so essential but you can wear these with over the knee boots or just like knee high boots i think they're really really cute kind of looks like a wrap skirt which i love i love wrap skirts but it does have a zipper and this one fits me big so i'm a little bummed i need to go get um a size two this is in a size four and this one goes for 25 bucks love it super simple and the length is perfect i am petite by the way i'm five one so um if you are petite i think that's definitely the right length all right so next we have these white pants i love these because these are more like trousers these are like off-white like a cream color these do fit me big so i have to go exchange them as well um these are in a size two and they are $30 I love them because like I said, they feel like a trouser and they're super, super comfy. They do have a nice stretch as well. They have them in three other colors. I think black, a camel color and a green color if I'm not mistaken. But I love these. These are so good for fall. You guys know leather for fall is a must. So I love these basic... Oh yeah, I was trying this on and I kind of like wanted to tuck it in so I crisscrossed the buttons. But this is kind of like a basic cardigan. I got this in a size extra small and it does fit me oversized. So I don't know if I'm going to keep it. I'm still thinking about it. I wanted something a little bit more snug so I can like tuck into my jeans or my leather pants and i think this is a little too oversized for me it is super soft i love target their knits are so soft um and if you take care of them they actually do last a long time this one might be going back um and this one is 28 dollars. and then last from target is this long cardigan i am obsessed with pieces like this because i think like you can totally make this into a statement piece uh you can wear super basics underneath like a pair of jeans a white tank top or like a long sleeve bodysuit and throw this on put on some booties and you're like automatically just ready for whatever i think it elevates any outfit okay and before i go on i also picked up two books i don't know if you guys heard about these books they're all over my tiktok i have ugly love and it ends with us i've heard both of these are addicting <laughs> so i picked them up they are on sale i think buy one get one 40 percent off so i picked up both of them i'm currently uh reading ugly love i started with this one i'm i think i'm on chapter two so far it's actually really good it's an easy read so yeah wanted to share these with you okay so next we have h&m i went to two different locations i live pretty much not in the middle but i live close to two malls that actually have an H&M store one is bigger than the other one and I like their selection better the other one's a little bit smaller but it's a little bit more convenient and when you go on a day that they like stock new things or whatever like you actually do find good things so on my first trip I actually picked up um, some of the things that I've been eyeing online and they were completely sold out um, but they had them in store which i was super happy about so the first thing is this leather skirt it is a leather vegan skirt and i love this because it just fits so perfect i think this is nice and plain it doesn't have anything on it um, and i can dress it up dress it down it doesn't fit me too tight which i'm okay with because i think leather is not forgiving at all but this one fits really nice and this one is 24.99 and i got it in a size four Okay, so next, I am obsessed with stripe sweatshirts and sweaters and tops. I think I'm seeing it all over my TikTok, all over Pinterest. Stripes are in right now. So I picked up this sweater. This is more like of a casual sweater. And it has this detail right here, which I really love. I think it makes it a little bit different. Super, super soft. I got it in a size 
large because like I said I wanted it to be casual and I want to wear it with biker shorts and you know like some sneakers I don't know just make it super casual I love this um, and this is $19.99 okay I've been eyeing these trousers <laughs> for a very long time but they're still sold out online I hope that when I upload this video they become available they do have two different sizes two different colors online um, this is a gray one they do have a black one as well and I love these because they have an elastic band and they still look dressy so these are trousers that you can wear to dinner to work totally dinner friendly because you can binge but I love the elastic and they feel like a glove like I said I am petite I'm 5'1 and the length of these are perfection I can wear sneakers or I can wear booties or heels and they still look really really good and these are $19.99 and I got it in a size extra small so I also picked up this shirt I love this I love everything about it the flare sleeves neckline it's just absolutely stunning I also got this in the cream color which I have another bag but I wanted to pick it up in brown and I think they do have another color I didn't find it the only thing I would say with this is size down if you wanted to fit you a little bit more snug so I got this one in a size small and the cream one in a size extra small and I like how the extra small fits me better than this one um the extra small is a little bit more snug here is the one in cream i already took off the tag because i wore this already and like i said i'm obsessed with it um so i also found another striped sweater i think this is a little bit more dressy the sleeves are a little bit awkward i feel like i don't know <laughs> They're definitely short. I don't know how I feel about it. So I'm still on the fence with this one I don't know if I'm gonna keep it or if I'm going to take it back But I do love how soft it is and this was $24.99 Okay, so I guess I'm really obsessed with stripes <laughs> I totally forgot about this one. So I also got a plain stripe sweater um, a sweatshirt I mean, I think this is definitely more casual and it's not as thick as the other one. It's a lot thinner. Um, which I guess that's why I got it. <laughs> I really don't know. But I love this. I love the stripes. This is totally like plain. It doesn't have anything on the back. I think the front is just like a, you know, plain stripe sweatshirt. And this was $29.99. And I don't know if I'm going to keep it or not. I never have good luck with H&M jeans they never fit me they always either fit me too uh, small on the waist or too long these fit me like a glove the waist fits perfectly the length is perfect I love the wash it has a nice stretch as well they're not too stiff and these were $24.99 which I was like okay wait I need the other wash it's a lighter wash but it's sold out um, online and I couldn't find it in store so yeah i love these they fit me so well they're just everything and last but not least i don't know how i feel about these i had an outfit put together and then i saw myself in the mirror and i just i don't know why i just couldn't i didn't like it i just couldn't do it um i tried it without socks with socks with black socks like i've tried it in so many different ways but i'm still on the fence i mean don't get me wrong, these are absolutely stunning and I think these were really affordable. I want to say maybe like 40 bucks, I don't know. But I think they are really nice. Um, they are heavy and they do have a thick platform, which is what I was looking for. But I don't know. I don't know if you guys have any suggestions on like any outfits that I should try with these. I have short legs. So I don't think these look good on me or do anything for me, which is why I'm like... You know not obsessed okay so next we have a huge Abercrombie order that came in I'm gonna start off with something that actually arrived today it was on back order for a couple of weeks and I didn't think I would get it but it actually shipped and I was so happy this jacket shacket however you want to say it it's a cropped shacket so I am obsessed with the color with how it fits it's absolutely beautiful. It's super fuzzy and soft. I'm literally going to wear this all the time. And I got this in a size small and it is 
$100. I believe I used a coupon. I think it was like a 20% coupon. So I got everything for like 20% off. So the next thing is this shirt. This is like a crinkly shirt. I don't know. I've seen a lot of these. So I got this in the medium because I did want like an oversized look. And this is 70 bucks. I also got this top. I love the zipper detail. The fact that you can like wear it like this open on top of a tank top. Or you can zip it up and like kind of lower it here if you want to show a little bit more cleavage. It is super lightweight. I love the color detail. And it is tight around the sleeves. And I got this in a size medium. Why would I get it in a medium? This is $70. Okay, I also got two of these sweatshirts. I can't remember where the other one is because I've worn it like several times and my daughters also have worn it. Let me see if I find it. Okay, I found it. So this is the one I've worn a couple of times already. I am obsessed. We all love it. Super soft. Um, Abercrombie sweatshirts are just the softest things ever. Honestly, love every single one of them. They are pricey, but they are just everything so i got that one in green it says new york and i also got this one in blue and it says paris um they are not long they are like you know like the perfect length okay i also got two of these tops which they're going back because i got the wrong size i got these in a medium thinking that i would need room but i would say like stay with your regular size because this is supposed to be a little bit snug. So I love the detail right here. I think it gives it a whole nother look. It's not just a simple tube top, you know. I got this in this color, which is like brown. And then I also got it in a black. Yeah, unfortunately, they are going back. Okay, so these pants. I was literally like obsessed with these. And I'm so heartbroken because they're going to have to go back. They don't fit me at all. They run so small, it's like ridiculous. So these are the cargo pants. I don't know where the tag, okay. So these are the cargo pants. I got it in a size 26 short, which is usually my size. Um, these go for $80, but the waist is like tiny. Like, I don't know. <laughs> it's literally tiny. It does have a little bit of stretch, but not much. And it is a stiff material, like regular cargo pants should be. So I don't know, my size right now is not available. So I have to wait, but we'll see. Okay, so I also got two bodysuits, uh, same ones in different colors because I love this like scuba material that Abercrombie has. It's amazing. It kind of like snugs you in and just shapes you and it's beautiful in so many different ways. I'm sorry about the lighting. The sun keeps coming in and out. Um, but yeah, so this is like a regular long sleeve bodysuit. But it has this detail in the front that you can tie it around your neck and make it a little bit like sexier or you can, you know, like pull it all the way up so nothing shows and just give it a different look. And these are $49. I got both of them in small. Wish I would have went for an extra small, but the small will do. Okay, so next I have this dress, which I am completely obsessed with. I haven't had the chance to wear it yet, but I can't wait to find it. An opportunity to wear this so i love everything about it the twist detail in the front is absolutely gorgeous it like shapes you really nicely because it cinches everything in and the sleeves are gorgeous and they do have different colors i got this in small petite and it's 80 bucks i only have a couple of things left so i got these jeans which are going back as well because i got them in short but they sent me a regular everything else fits amazing though i think they are a little bit summery because the wash is light but i do like this detail and i can always pair it with like a black top to make it a little bit more like you know fallish abercrombie jeans are just amazing okay so i have two more items to show you these are all the same pants these are the trousers that went viral on tiktok and because they went viral they were so hard to get so these are the high-waisted wide leg trousers which i am obsessed with that's why i had to get all of them i got them in black um i got this like brown and i also got it in navy blue i'm obsessed with them but these fit so beautiful they fit right at the waist they kind of cinch you in because they have like this elastic band which just cinches you in i got these in short so the length is perfect 
and these are all small as well all right and the last thing that i have to show you from abercrombie are these pans i don't have anything that looks like this um the color is stunning it is like a cargo pants but in the leather like a faux leather version i love that the pockets are big i don't know if you guys know this but the bigger the pocket the bigger your booty looks these were a little bit pricey though they are 110 dollars but I think it's like, you know, that piece in my closet that I'm going to be able to wear a lot. I could dress it up. I could dress it down. I can't wait to wear these. Okay, so this was totally an impulse buy. I kind of regretted it a little bit. But once they got here and I tried them on, I was completely obsessed. So I love Store Wizman's booties. I think they are just stunning. I have a couple and I've worn the heck out of them. And they still look brand new like they hold up so good they're so well made and they're just beautiful they are pricey so it's definitely an investment but you know they're gonna last so i have a pair of beige leather and black leather booties like soft booties but i didn't have a pair of suede booties so i went with these and i wanted the brown ones too so bad which i think i'm going to get next but i don't know, I have to take my bank account is like girl take a break i've worn these already and they're so comfortable just like the other ones i do like that it has a thin heel the other ones have more of like that thicker block heel so these are a little bit different i think they're a little bit more dressy which i really like like always i'll link everything so you guys can go check it out i'm on my way to get some coffee because i am so hungry and I'm sorry if this is shaking. I got something from Amazon to put the camera on because I wanted to be able to put it in my car. Well, actually today I'm driving Hubby's car and I think it's working good, but it is a little too shaky, so I have to figure that out. But yes, anywho, we're going to Target. No, we're not going to Target. <laughs> I know I want to go to Target, but we're not going to go to Target. We're actually going to go to Starbucks right now. And then um, I got to go to the mall to pick something up at Sephora. But it's going to be like literally really quickly. And I think I want to stop by Mango. I shouldn't. I really shouldn't. But maybe I will. And then I'm going to go to my favorite place, which is Home Goods. I want to pick up some things to organize my bathroom like under the sink this is this is like shaking way too much i need to get stuff to organize my bathroom like under the sink i have way too many things and i need to figure it out like a way to organize that stuff so that's the plan thank you you too all about the first sip right <laughs> all right it's actually really good the toasted vanilla syrup mm, it is yummy all right guys we made it to home goods the mall was actually super quick um i didn't go anywhere else this is a new location they just opened it up a couple of weeks ago it's super close to my house and it looks to be a really big store so i'm excited to see I love home goods. I feel like I can be here all day browsing and shopping. But yeah, let's see what we find. Good morning, guys. I'm currently having my first coffee of the day. It's a little cold today, um, but I'm still having my iced coffee. So yesterday, I left you guys at Home Goods. Unfortunately, I didn't find what I was looking for. I bought other things that I knew I needed, but I really wasn't looking for them. But then after, I went to Target and I actually found what I was looking for. I think even better than the ones that I was planning on buying from Amazon. So I'm gonna put you down and I'll show you guys what I got. Okay, so from Home Goods, I got a set of pillows. I love these because they're super fluffy and they're big. I think they are the European size. And then I also got a new set of sheets and pillow covers. So I'm glad I actually found the matching ones. Usually you don't find the matching sets. After that, I went to Target. And like I said, I wanted to find something to organize the stuff under my sink. My bathroom is looking a little crazy. So the ones that I wanted to get from Amazon 
were a little different than the ones that I got but these are a lot bigger. So I think these are going to work better. So I got two sizes to see um, how many I will need. And I got a bunch of these. So I got these. These are like, uh, they're from the brand Bright Room and they are stackable bins. So this is one of them. I got about six of these. And then I also got the smaller size and um, I got two of these to see how many I'll fit. So I know I'm going to need more. And I'll show you guys uh, when I organize my bathroom. I'll try to put some clips here so you guys can see. And then I also picked up a couple of things that I needed. So I also got this sink caddy, which I've been needing this like desperately. I hate having the sponges and everything just laying around. So I think that's going to help me be more organized in my kitchen. And then I also got this, which is from the same brand, Bright Room. So I'm thinking about putting this I don't know if I'm going to leave this out or if I'm going to put it under the sink. I'm not sure. Depending on what, you know, the storage that I have. So I'm going to finish my coffee and I'm going to get to organizing. I should be embarrassed to show you guys this. <laughs> but this is how things have been. So now I'm just going to take everything out and let's see what happens. Because it can't. I can no longer do this. We are looking so good. So now I'm going to start placing bins. I haven't taken any of the stickers off yet, but I just want to see how much space I have to work with. Okay, so this is what I have so far. I am so happy with how this is turning out. I do have my hot rollers that I need to find a place for. And I also have this bag of brushes that I need to figure out. I should go through this, but I don't know. But other than that, I am so happy with the way it turned out. This is amazing compared to how it was before. This is like a whole nother household. <laughs> I have to get to the other bathroom, my daughter's bathroom, and hopefully I can free up some space and I can find somewhere to put this. All right, so I ended up doing the same thing to this bathroom. I love how it turned out. I need to tell the girls to figure this out because it was not like that. <laughs> But I used the same things from Target, the same bins and everything, and we organized everything. I threw out so many things, and I feel like our life is together now. It just keeps everything so organized. The counters are free of anything it's just everything is being kept here i am seriously so happy at how everything turned out i'm so glad i didn't give up when i didn't find the stuff i needed at home goods and i'm actually very happy that i didn't buy the stuff from amazon because i think they would have been way too small and i would have needed a lot more so that's it guys i hope you enjoyed the video if you haven't yet make sure to subscribe so i know you're enjoying my content and like always thank you so much for watching and i'll talk to you guys later